Welcome! In front of me I have a Huawei Watch GT4 and I'm gonna show you how to pair this watch with the iPhone. First thing we need to do is to uh, turn on our watch. And you can turn it on by pressing and holding the uh, crown button. Keep holding the button until you see the Huawei logo on the screen. Once you see the logo, you can release the button and wait until the watch turns on. After the watch turns on, um, you will see the list of languages on the screen. So let's wait, because it's still turning on. As you can see, like I said, you will see the list of languages. Now you can scroll through this list, find the language you would like to use on your watch, and once you find it, you can tap on it to select it. And after you select the language, you will see on the screen that we need to download and install the Huawei Health application. So, open the App Store uh, on your iPhone. Also, make sure you have the internet connection and Bluetooth enabled. Once you do, open the App Store, tap on search, type in uh, Huawei Health, scroll down for the list, find the Huawei Health application, tap on it, then tap on the Get button to download and install it. And once the application is done installing, you can tap on Open to open it. In the app, uh, you will see some pop-ups about permissions, for example, notification permission. This is uh, required if you want to uh, receive the notifications from your iPhone on your watch. So if you want to do it, receive the notifications on your watch, tap on Allow. If you don't care, you can deny it. Then tap on Next, Agree, tap on Let's Go, and here you can uh, allow some permissions for the health uh, features. Basically, we can allow to uh, the health app to write the data and read data from features like active energy, heart rate and stuff like that. So if you want to use any of these features, you need to allow the uh, permission by tapping on the switch to enable it. And once you enable uh, the ones you like, you can tap on allow right here. And finally, uh, once you're done with the permissions, you should see the health page the app, tap on devices, tap on add device, tap on OK, tap on add device again, it will start scanning for nearby devices and it should, you sh should see your Huawei Watch GT4. Tap on connect, tap on the check mark on the watch, tap on pair, tap on allow or deny to allow or deny the permissions for the uh, notifications. And here, check the box and tap on next. Right here, we can allow or deny the permission for the uh, location. This is required if you want to track your routes for like uh, for activities like running, cycling, and stuff like that. If you want to do it, tap on allow. If you don't care, you can deny it. And next, we have the access to your contacts, and this is required for the uh, maybe notifications about calls and stuff like that. So allow it or deny it. And here we can allow the access for the calendar. You can allow it or deny it. Okay. And once you're done with the permissions, you will see this page. And here you can check the box if you want to, to up enable the auto download update packages over Wi Fi. And then you can tap on done. And at this point, you should see the device page for your Huawei Watch GT4, which means that the devices are fed together. If you go to your watch, you can go through the tutorial. And once you're done with the tutorial, you will be able to use your watch. And that's how you pair this watch with the iPhone. Thank you for watching. If you found this video helpful, please consider subscribing to our channel and leaving the like on the video.